we're here on Bribey Island. <laughs> here on Bribey Island, we're gonna show everyone around the, uh, the area a little bit. I'm actually not from here. Brent's actually gonna be leading the convoy today, showing Very us true. around and uh, yeah, showing his uh, stomping ground. Stomping ground? Stomping ground. John, what are, what are you what are you doing right now, huh? What are you doing right now, huh? He's taking a bit of air out of the tires, mate. Ah, oh, that's very nice. Do you want to explain the in-depth detail of it? Yeah, so I've got these, uh... Oh, wow, that's, ve that's very nice, Sean. How excited are you? That's too much, mate. Oh, Brad! Wow! wow. Today, we're on the lovely Brabio Island. We're shooting some content. We're going to check out some lagoons, hit some of the tracks, and have a good look around. Right off the rip, the trusty old Triton which is actually brand new, good as gold, not a thing wrong with it. We've got Sean's built Ranger over here. Something's going on with the battery. It's flat, we don't have a fridge in there. You know, I've got my Esky on hand, so you know, an Esky can never go flat if you have enough ice. Bone stock Triton versus Sean's Ranger. First one to get stuck loses pretty dramatically. I know what car I've got my bet on. It's the Ranger. We've made it to the second lagoon. Today, it's actually pretty nice. There isn't a big washout here, so we can drive past it, no worries at all. Surprisingly, the Triton made it here, no worries at all. The cutting coming in was a bit... It's gonna be an OE rebate. Get out of the car! Thank you, man. Okay, so we've made it up to the second lagoon here on Bribey. Uh, today, it's not washed out, it's not blown out, so we can actually drive past it, no worries at all. So Sean's Ranger has half a chance of making it the whole way up the beach. My Triton, Good as gold. You cannot fault it. Just look at it. It is a beautiful piece of kit here. Nice and clean. Unlike Sean's car where he didn't even take the effort to wash his car before coming up here to film some videos. I want to do a dram dramatic zoom. Dramatic zoom. Um, surprising dramatic that it's doing zoom. good. <laughs> so Sean is weighed down with a uh, with a pretty serious train canopy set up on the back there. He's got the Drifter rooftop tent. He's got the G-Works tray, G-Works canopy. But he does have the big Yokohama Geolanders on there that, you know, just tear the beach up like it's nothing. Dramatic it's zoom! Very bright. Dramatic zoom. <laughs> From here, we've, uh, we've just got a few drone shots. Uh, we've got a few you know, still photos of the cars here. From here, we're going to keep heading north, straight up the surf side of the beach. Go check out the bunkers. Go see if we can get up the northern access track. We did see a sign on the way in that um, it says it's closed. So, you know, if it is closed, we're not going to go up there and push that one. But, um, but we'll, we'll see what kind of trouble we can get into up on the, uh, the northern end of the beach. We've, uh, we've found an obstacle, I'm not 100% sure which lagoon this is, but it's got a bit of a step up. Honestly, Sean's Ranger will be able to do it, no worries at all. Uh, but the front end of my Tritons is that little bit too low. It doesn't usually look like that. No, it's usually just straight in. We could, we could definitely do it down the end. So a bone stock Triton does this fine. Sean's being a bit of a sook and he's gonna whinge about this one. I can feel it. Almost like it's built for it. Did you find beers? <laughs> nah, show me when we get up there. Did you find the stuff? I feel like that crossing is just going to be a little bit worse on the way back. We'll soon find out, I guess. So we've made it to the furthest point north that we can drive. We've got the bunker here out in the water. What we're going to do is we're going to double back, get to a spot where we've got a nice big bit of sand so we can keep doing what we've got to do today. And we've got to try and beat it back because uh, there's a heap of sticks in the way and we don't want to get stuck. Let's go! Let's go. We've um, snaked a little wholesome campsite. It does look very nice. Oh my god, look at lizard. What? That's a goanna, so it's film it. Ah. I am filming it. Yay. Sorry, just Instagramming. All right, so we've just been up in one of the campsites here filming a few product review videos and stuff like that. 
you know, really soaking in the environment around here at Bribey. We don't really have that much else going on this afternoon. I think we've just got a few more videos we're going to tidy up. Uh, we're going to uh, probably smash it back down the beach when the tide goes down a bit because unfortunately Bribey just, it's not a very wide beach. So we don't really have that much uh, hard sand to play with. If we, uh, if we decided to take it back now, it'd be quite a hard slog. That washout that we passed coming up here, it'd be, you know, it'd be pretty deep. I don't think I'd get my stock car through it comfortably or at least as comfortably as I'd like to. Bear in mind that car is just over a month old. It's only got a couple of thousand Ks on it. Uh, you know, I, the last thing I want to do today is sink it. Um, we've got Sean right now. He's just trying to sort out some 12 volt issues he's having with his big setup on the back. Uh, for some reason, the car itself isn't actually charging the, uh, the, the battery in the back. Um, solar panels are still doing it, so we've still got a bit of battery power there, but, um, but we've had to turn his fridge off and rely on the old trusty Esky in the back of mine to, uh, to get us where we're going with some nice cold beverages. Uh, what are your thoughts, Sean? Yeah, well, according to Red Arc, we disconnect the secondary battery, disconnect the main battery, disconnect any loads, disconnect solar, leave it for a few minutes, and it should fix itself. So we'll see. Fingers crossed. Yeah, fingers crossed. But, real talk, Triton, bonnet, still down. I've actually got time to, uh, to give it a bit of a buff, you know? <laughs> Gotta make it look good out here. <laughs> Guess what's happening? Struggling. Struggling. Why? It, anything else? <laughs> Right, guys we've got one more video to film today and that unfortunately led me to getting my Triton stuck let it be known this was intentional this vehicle will drive straight out of here no worries at all but we are gonna get it way more stuck and you'll be able to see that in the video at a later date meanwhile Sean's Ranger probably won't make it off the beach because it's gonna run out of fuel of course Sean walks in the way I'm just gonna get a funny video yeah, no, no, I'm good. Thanks for asking. It's fine. Just out here taking one for the team, getting my perfectly capable vehicle that can't actually get stuck, stuck. All right, guys, it's been an absolutely ripper day out here on Bribey Island. The weather really turned up for us. I don't think we could have asked for a better day. Brent, how do you think you went? I know you got stuck a few times and I had to pull you out. Look. I got stuck intentionally, uh, you know, we were out here filming some content for our YouTube channel and yeah. also our website. That's what they all say. Yeah, yeah, look, like, at end of the day, I cooked you lunch and I got to put my hot meat in your mouth. Yeah, so. and you know what, at the end of the day, it was pretty delicious. It, I, so. I know, I know, yeah. I know. <laughs> but, um, but like seriously, you know, like the Triton, she is stock. It has outperformed itself today. Um, you know, end of the day, it's just Bribey Beach driving, so it's not the hardest thing to do. But um, I've definitely got the bug now to start modifying it and getting some more bits and pieces on there. Exactly, and it goes to show you don't need a crazy modified vehicle like the Ranger to come out here and have a bit of fun. So that's going to be us for the day. Yeah, we're just going to uh, hit the frog and toad, you know, and uh, hopefully get out of the cutting without uh, the Ranger getting stuck or running out of fuel because we all know that's a bit low at the moment. Yeah. But, um, but you know, it's, uh, it's all part of the fun and of, 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 of getting out here and getting a part of it. So That's it, and we'll see you next time. Catch you next time. Like and subscribe, motherfuckers. Like and subscribe, motherfuckers. All right, time to go home. <laughs> oh, it's an hour of ride. Do you think it would be funny if one of us, like, got stuck leaving and then we had to stay here for, like, another four hours? I do not have and the patience And then Sean would have a Menti B. I'll have a Menti B. film it? I'll have a Menti B if that drone's not in the air in two seconds. I will literally just leave you behind. Okay. <laughs> I'll leave Ben behind. I'll just go home. Like if he got stuck? No, that's not true. If you got stuck and he had to help you, he would not leave you behind. Oh no, I You're would. You're talking shit. If you got yourself no, stuck, I would be like, you can find someone else to help you around.